This is an overview of the Asus Ycast EW2000 wireless HDMI kit. What it allows you to do is transmit an HDMI signal wirelessly from your laptop over to your TV, all without the use of cords, which is a beautiful thing. Um, inside the box it comes with uh, two main pieces are the transmitter here, and on the back of the transmitter you've got a little power input in case you don't want to power it with the USB ports. It's got the USB ports which um, if you don't want to mess with the power adapter you can power it using the USB ports on your computer and then it's got an HDMI port with uh, the included small HDMI cable. And on the other end of it is the receiver piece and on, I mean it's just a small box that sits next to your TV. Um, I don't know what to compare it to size wise but it's pretty small um, you can see here and on the back of it it has a couple H or it has one HDMI port and it's got the power input and then it's got a little uh, mini USB port on it which um, had a rubber cover on it that uh, I'm guessing is used for service use and so we'll leave that there it's connected up and uh, the laptop I'm using is a uh, mid-2010 MacBook Pro, and uh, it's got audio, or it, one of the features is that it outputs audio through its mini DVI port, so um, in order to make it work on a, on a laptop like this is I have this uh, adapter cable from Griffin, it's the mini DVI to HDMI adapter cable, um, and that makes it work with these MacBooks. So uh, the first step here is to, we will go ahead and plug in the adapter cable here. Okay, we've got that connected, and then um, since the MacBook Pro's USB ports um, output higher uh, voltage, more power than an average laptop, it only requires one of these to power the device. So we see here that we got uh, we've got lights on the device, and if we look over here, I should see my wallpaper, which I do. So if we open up iTunes back over on the laptop here. And I drag it over, um, as you can see, it is uh, displaying everything. It's very low latency. Um, I think the marketing materials say less than one millisecond, which seems to be pretty accurate. Um, I can't uh, discern any kind of lag. Um, so if we drag it back over here, drag iTunes back over here, uh, let's start up some 1080p content. So. I am going to open up Plex, the um, Media Center app. I've got a pretty sizable movie library uh, on my Drobo in another part of my house. Uh, so actually Plex starts up over here. And you can't, um, can't, you might not be able to hear it in the video, but the audio is actually playing out of my TV. So let's go to movies here. Movies and let's see. We will... Play the 40 year old virgin, and I've got a menu selection there. We'll resume it from 13 minutes. So, this is streaming across the network and then transmitted wirelessly from the MacBook to um, the TV. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Yo, answer this question Are you a virgin? Are you a virgin? So there we go. That is a quick demonstration of the Asus Ycast um, EW2000 wireless HDMI kit. Um, so far I'm loving it. 